Hey guys. All right, so this week we are starting something new. We're going to call Fluency Fridays, okay? You will notice your child got a purple folder in their materials on Friday. And in this material, there are six weeks worth of um, story passages that you are going to be doing with your child, okay? So on Fridays, this is gonna be our main focus. So we won't have as much work on Fridays as normal because this is gonna take probably between 15 and 20 minutes total, all right? So what you're gonna do, once you open your child's purple folder, there will be six passages in the folder that your child will be reading from. And then in the very back of the folder, there'll be a sheet protector that says parent copy or grown up copy, okay? So parents or grown ups, you will need the one that has the um, recording information on it, okay? So it will have somewhere for you to write day one, day two, day three, okay? And this will be we're not gonna do it over three days, we're gonna do it three different times, okay? So, what you're gonna do is we are going to be working on your child's fluency by having them read the same passage three times in a row, okay? Now, what we're looking for, we're not looking for fast, so we're not looking for super speed, we are looking for accuracy and fluency. So, are they reading it with the correct, um, expression? Are they stopping at their periods? Are they um, reading them like a question mark? Okay, so it's very important that you don't add, tell your child to rush. You don't want them to read it as fast as they possibly can. We want them to read it as fluent as they possibly can. Okay, so the first time your child reads it, you are going to use your stopwatch. Okay, so we're going to see we're, they're not gonna have a certain amount of time they have to read it in. We're gonna see how long does it take them to read it, okay? So, you're going to let them read the story. You're gonna mark down any words on your copy that they missed, and then you'll tell them about it, you'll review those words, and then you'll let them read it again. All right, so we're gonna show you kind of what it looks like. All right, here we go, are you ready? All right, what is the title? Boat ride. All right, truck and finger. All right, whenever you are ready, you may begin. I like boat ride. Boats are fun on air. Wait. Good job. We live. Near mm -hmm. a lake, my friend Bob has a boat. His boat is small. We are all that fast on it. It just has one or or rob rose rose us around good job all right so, I didn't let her read the whole thing, but you get the point. So, what you're gonna do is you'll mark any words that they miss, and then once they're finished, we'll go back and we'll say, okay, this word right here is fit, instead of fast. And then you might have them repeat it back to you. So, what is this word? Fit. 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 Very good. And this word is or, or. like the word, the things you use to row a boat. And this word is rose. Rose. Very good, okay, and once you've done that, then you'll go back and you will have, you'll write this down, so I might say, okay, that was three minutes and 45 seconds, okay? Then you'll go back and you'll have them read it again, and hopefully they'll time, their time will improve, but you don't want them to read super fast. That is the biggest thing, is we want some of our really good readers to slow down, 
okay? So, they're not trying to read super fast, not reading super slow, we're reading with fluency and expression, all right? So, if you have any questions about what to do today, you can let me know. Now, the one thing I wanted to let you know, before your child reads it the third time, okay, I want you to log on to Seesaw and have your child record themselves while they're reading it. So yes, you're still gonna be tracking their time, but I want their, them to read it so that I can hear how they read it the third time. Then you can add a new slide to that activity and take a picture of your paper and um, show me what they did, all right? So I hope you guys enjoy doing repeated readings. If you have any questions, let me know. Thank you.